what's up guys so i wanted to do a video touching on realistic expectations and what it feels like when the gods visit you so you're doing your rituals and prayers and you're lighting your candles and your incense and you're praying to the gods and then all of a sudden you feel like there's someone in the room and you get this feeling of peace and that's what it's like when the gods attend your ritual or prayers it's kind of hard to describe this is for people that are wondering, that are just beginning, that they want to know how they know if the gods are listening. So the gods are always listening, but how you know when they're actually with you in ritual is that the atmosphere will, atmosphere will change. I kind of like to think of it as, you know, whenever you're working and you have your back turned and you feel like you can just tell there's someone else in the room and it turns out to be one of your friends or whatever they walked into the room you didn't physically see them but you know they're there just because you can feel that there's someone in the room with you that's kind of what it feels like whenever the gods come to you while you're performing your rituals and prayers and for me personally that is the time in particular i like to actually pray and thank them even stronger. It, it helps the ritual even more because they, you know they're there and they're physically and spiritually there. So they're there in attendance, I guess you could say. So they want, so you know that when you pray, they're actually there like, I'm here. Let me know what you want to say and all that, you know, in a better way, but that's my bad way of describing it. But you, it's the feeling of knowing that they're there and they're actually listening. Now, I want to talk about ritual expectations, meaning that we do not pray expecting this every time. For the guys to attend every single ritual and prayer, it would almost feel like we're calling them and we're doing it just to get that feeling of them being there and their presence. And then over time, it won't become that special when you feel it every single time because it's just they're there again. And, then, and that's also to say that if you do rituals and prayers, that the gods are ignoring you. A lot of people, they get hooked on that feeling, <laughs> like the song, Hooked on a Feeling. Uh, of that feeling of the feeling of God's presence, and then they go to do the rituals and prayers, expecting that feeling again, and then it's nothing. It's just them in an empty room, and they think the gods have abandoned them and have forsaken them. When all that is not true, is that they may have gotten in their heads that every time they pray and they feel the gods that they're doing it right, and whenever they don't feel anything, then they're not they're doing something wrong. And that's not necessarily true. So I want to do a video to touch on that for those people that feel like they've been they used to have that experience of feeling the gods. And all of a sudden, it's been months, and I'm doing rituals, and I don't feel anything anymore. Um, I can't answer, I can't put words in the God's mouth or yours, but I can just tell you that the gods are still listening, and you have not offended them. Like I've said in other videos, that you can't do anything that people have been already done thousands of years ago, because they've been around. I know it feels like we do something new, and we've messed up, but they've seen it all so i just want to let you guys know that don't give up about that the gods still hear you and for those of you who never experienced it and i always talk about how you feel your presence and why do we even pray and all this um that that's what the presence it feels like anyway guys i just want to do a short video just touching on um the gods when they attend our rituals i guess you could say and i also wanted to touch on when you do rituals and you pray and it feels like no one's listening or you don't feel anything. Just keep it up, guys, and don't give up on yourselves because the gods don't give up on you. And I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye.